Hi guys, it's Jim here, one of the Extreme Booters. Um, for those of you who don't know, or if you're new to the channel, I'm Jim, I'm a full-time eBay reseller. I buy stuff at car book sales, charity shops, auctions, etc., etc., um, for cheap, and sell it for a profit on eBay. Or at least that's the plan. Um, obviously it's coming to the end of car boot season at the moment. Um, so we need new ways of finding stock. Um, last year we did pick up some big bundles of clothing which we did very well on so I've decided to buy some more. Um, this one has just arrived, this box that you just see here next to me. Um, this is a, a bundle of vintage clothing from Vault Vintage Wholesale. I'll put a link to their website down below. Um, they had a special offer on. Um, Andrew at uh, Money Mental did a um, bought a job lot from them, uh, and he did an unboxing, and they um, gave us a code for twenty percent off, which was I think Money Mental twenty or something like that. So I ordered um, twenty kilos of men's vintage clothing. Um, it's normally one hundred and thirty pounds for ten kilos. Um, so it normally sells in 10 kilos, but you can select how many kilos you want. Um, so that would be 260 pounds, obviously, with 20% off, be 42. No, it wouldn't 260, 52, uh, 200 and something pounds. I don't know how much it was. Um, so it's literally just arrived today. I haven't opened it yet. I'm going to do that now. Uh, obviously, being careful with this, this is a dangerous thing. Um, I don't want to ruin any clothing. So I'm going to just slice open the box and then we're going to take a look and see what stuff we've got. I've not ordered from Vault Vintage before. Um, I know people have had very, very good results from there. So um, fingers crossed, we will too. Let's have a look, see what we've got. I'm going to put the bag down here, box even. And I'm going to delve in, see what we got. Right then, so there's a good mixture of stuff by the looks of things. We've got some Keep Smiling. That's a bit of a jazzy shirt. I'll probably wear that myself, to be fair. There we go, got a nice shirt there. Oh, that's all right. Nike hoodie. You can normally buy um, branded or unbranded um, clothing from Vault. Um, but because of using this special code, this bundle should contain roughly half branded and, and half not. A pair of old um, sort of hiking shorts. Very nice. A pair of jeans. G-Star Raw. They should sell reasonably well. An old jacket. Eddie Bauer. Blimey. Probably all heard of Eddie Bauer. I think it's a ladies' jacket. Yeah, really pleased with that. That's a downfield Eddie Bauer jacket. Um, it is quite hairy. I don't know whether whoever used to own that had a cat, but I'll get one of them pet hair rollers on that and get that. That's going to be at least forty quid, if not more, because it's downfield. That's a that's a nice coat. Onwards and upwards. All Saints. Never heard of them. Um, sort of sports jacket. Um, it's okay. Leather jacket. Leather jacket. Gap. That's nice. Vintage Gap jacket. Sort of a biker's jacket style. It's actually quite nice, isn't it? That. That's got to go again. At least for twenty, thirty pound. I'd have thought. Very good show. Uh, long jacket. This one. Les Copans, or Les Copans. I presume that's French. That's sort of a, well, it's like a, a um, sailor's jacket. That's really nice. That is nice. Got the emblem on the side there. I quite like that. That'd probably fit me, you know. Oof. Buttons on it are amazing, look. Proper shiny, like gold. Lovely. I, again, I don't know the value of that. I've never had um, a jacket like that, but I'll steamer that. That'll come up lovely. Um, 
again, probably 30, 35, I'd have thought on that, no problem at all. That's a Lee. It's a shirt. It's it's kind of well, it's I don't know what um you would describe that. It's like um viscose. They're like football shirts are made of. Uh, it just says cotton polyester, but that's a yeah, that's gonna uh, that's gonna irritate certain areas. I'd have thought if you get to say. Anyway, nice Lee. Obviously, Lee's a top brand. Can't argue with Lee. Lee vintage stuff. I've got a Lee vintage denim jacket that I got at the charity shop for three quid. I've got on for ninety quid. Um, I'd have thought that shirt should be fifteen. No problem at all. Pair of over trousers. Burghouse trouser. I'll tell you what, we've done, we've done it right here, haven't we? So Burghouse over trousers. Those are incredible. Medium, 31 leg. Again, we've got to be looking at oh, 15, 20 quid. Perfect time of the year for those as well, obviously. If you're going to go out hiking or or anything, then they're perfect. Oh, means. Um, lovely Wrangler polo. Wrangler, again, good brand. Vintage polo shirt, nice. Probably 12 to 15 on that one. Easily. Another jacket here. What have we got here? Levi's, that's a really nice shirt. I actually like that myself. Hidden buttons, poppers, extra large. I've sold quite a few Levi's shirts recently um, and I they all go for 25 if not more. So that's, that's very good indeed. Oh wow, look at that. Jacket there, sheepskin style. Try and see if there's a brand on it. I don't think there is, but that's not a particular problem. Shearing, Feibock, made in Italy. But it's, yeah, lovely sheepskin. Again, perfect for this time of the year. It's vintage, 30 quid again, maybe. I don't know. So yeah, we're, we're doing all right here, aren't we guys? What we got here? Nautica. Uh, sweatshirt, sort of polar neck, very nice. Again, it's kind of well, it's kind of like a hoodie without a hood, but it's got a polar neck. If that makes sense, again, twenty odd maybe, maybe more. Oh my word! I think I think the last thing has uh, slightly blown me away. Um, oh wow! I'm going to have to stand up for this one, guys. It's a feeler ski suit. Look at it. Wow. I mean, there you go, look, feeler. I mean, okay, that's, you know, weighs a few kilos, but goodness gracious. It's even got a key holder on it. Look. So there we go. Well, how much is a ski suit going to be? I, I, I've sold head and similar um, vintage ski suits for up to 80, 90 quid a, a time. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm quite blown away with that. That's awesome. So Alex at Vault Vintage, thank you. Thank you so much. I, I'm, I'm amazed at the stuff I've got here. Um, I'm going to quickly have a look through, totally it up and see where we are. So, uh, wow. Right, so I've just quickly gone through um, the items. Um, checked on eBay for rough things and just written down uh, where I am. And yeah, I'm pleased. Really, 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 really good. Um, sales price for all of the items will be somewhere in the region of between 320 to 375 pounds. So that's pretty good. Um, if I can get to the top end, 375, maybe push it up, maybe get 400. From only spending 220, it's easily a £100 profit. Um, the items are all good. Um, that jacket, obviously, it was owned by a cat owner before it went to Malt Vintage, so it does need a, a brush down, but I'm not going to complain about that. That is nothing 
I can't deal with. There's no holes, there's no marks on the stuff. The stuff is really, really good quality. Obviously, I've bought from other um, vintage wholesalers in the past and, and you can get some stuff that's just unsellable. But this stuff is all really good. Um, really, really pleased. Um, so, yeah, I will definitely be going back. I know that there is an offer on, on the website anyway for people who are new. Your first order, you get 10% off. So, you know, it's it, it, it's it's a saving. That would make it, uh, it's 130 for 10 kilos. So that'd be 13 pounds off, which would make it 117 pound for um, 10 kilos. So if you halved my value of 350, um, that's 175. So you're making 60 pounds. Um, from 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 ten kilos easy. That's if you just get the same stuff as I get. Obviously, you may get different stuff. Um, I'm 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 really really happy with what I've got here. Um, I'll definitely be ordering some more. Um, so yeah, all I can do is recommend them. They're they're really really good. Um, I have got another um, big order coming through from another um, vintage. No. So I'll be going back at some point time in the future. Um, so yeah, really happy. It's some more stock for me. It's some more money. It's some more faces coming into the store to look at my items. Um, I've got quite a lot of vintage clothing on there at the moment. So obviously, um, fingers crossed, I'll get some good sales from this and that might spread to other items as well. Um, so let's get ironing. Let's get listing. Let's get making some money. Thank you again to Vault Vintage. I will be back. Thanks for watching, guys. If you haven't already, subscribe. Please um and hit the bell and everything else like the video etc um yeah and i'll see you again soon so um thanks for watching guys and i will see you later bye, -bye.